I'm Wendy here from Dress So Cute. In this video, we're going to draw my Dress So Cute sushi set. So let's get started. With this sushi set, I went ahead and drew my plate, which is basically a very thin rectangle. And the reason you want to draw this first is so that it'll be easier for you to draw your sushi on top of it and it can anchor your sushi well. And so just note that you're going to be drawing three items on this um, dish. So just make sure you have enough room for your wasabi. <laughs> And so I'm going to come about right here. I'm going to give myself some room on the edge and I'm going to start to draw my first sushi, which is the shrimp one. And so I'm going to come here and basically going to draw very small curves straight down. And the small little curves are basically trying to mimic the rice. I'm going to come around and I'm going to do the same thing. Other side, I'm going to come about right here. So I'm going to measure about one sushi two sushi and I still have some room sir, for my wasabi <laughs> and so I'm going to come across about right there and I'm going to do the same thing just going to curve it and you're basically trying to draw a um, the bottom of a soft rectangle so I'm just going to go around and so then when I come to the bottom here I'm just going to come in here and draw these little curves towards the bottom. You don't really see it, but you do see the tiny little curves that go up. And so from there, we got our rice in. I'm going to come up and I'm going to draw a big curve. It's kind of like drawing his hat, which is what the um, shrimp is. <laughs> and I'm going to curve it up. And so I'm going to curve it up and bring it around. So this is the shrimp. I'm going to go all the way around and so when I saw this drawing, it's just the cutest thing and I had to draw it for you guys. Whoever came up with this uh, shrimp for a hat was uh, a genius. <laughs> and so come around here and we're going to tie it off. So this is going to be the shrimp's tail. So I'm going to draw kind of like a leaf, one curve. And so another one right here in the back, shorter one, tuck it in. And so that's the shrimp's tail. And come in here for some details. You're going to draw some curves. So let's say about right here, just some stripes at an angle. So I guess I could put one more here and one more here. So we got the shrimp hat in and let's bring him to life. So right here towards the edge right here, I'm going to draw a circle. Towards the middle, I mean, and another one. So I'm going to come about right here. And I'm going to give him draw so cute eyes. So two small circles at an angle, curved line at the bottom and shade in the top. So if I ever go too fast for you guys to follow, please just push the pause button and um, then you can catch up much easier. So I hope I'm not going too fast or too slow. So two small circles here, same thing, and curve line at the bottom and shade in the top. So who here dares to eat raw sushi? <laughs> I'm okay about it. <laughs> I'm not a big uh, sushi connoisseur. I only eat certain kinds like salmon and uh, yellowtail. The other kinds I'm kind of iffy about. <laughs> so up here, curve line at the top, curve line at the top to anchor his eye. And right here in the center, I'm going to give him a cute little smile and cap it off on both sides. And so then right here, just for some details, come in here, just a little curve, just to make it look like it's not um, flat. Just give them some dimension. So now we've got the grilled sushi. So about 
I kind of measured that's how big he was about her and then you still have some room for your wasabi so I guess how much room you have left will, <laughs> will determine how skinny or fat your wasabi is so I'm gonna do the same thing so I'm gonna come close to this guy right here I'm gonna draw the same thing so I'm just gonna curve down once again curve it around come over and curve Little curves go around and so same thing towards the bottom there's a little plate right here just draw curves and so for her um, she's a nice piece of uh, raw fish <laughs> whatever fish you want so right here I'm gonna draw a curve and it's a little bit fancy it's gonna have a little flap that comes down because it's a nice big piece of sashimi and around. So I'm gonna bring it around. And oh, I got too close. And I'm gonna go around and connect it. And so for her, I'm just gonna give some stripes also. So I guess this could be salmon. fish that you like so some stripes with some details and on top here I just wanted to fancy her up so I added some caviar so towards the center just draw some little circles just to mimic caviar so I'm just gonna pile them up in a little dollop of caviar and I'm gonna add some greenery to it so a lot of times you see in those sushis, those little pieces of green, those fake leaves. So I'm just going to add a little piece right there. This is kind of like a little crown almost. And so then from there, let's bring her to life. So right here, I'm going to draw a circle as well, just like him. So two circles. And so this one will be a little bit covered. And to draw so cute eyes, so two small circles at an angle, curve line, and shade in the top. And lines at the bottom. So same thing here, two small circles, curve line, oops, I messed up right there. <laughs> and shade in the top. And lines at the bottom. Thank you for being so forgiving when I mess up, you guys. <laughs> and so, right there, we're gonna give her lashes on the edges. And lashes right here. And curve on the top. And for her, we're gonna give her a cute little smile. So right here, I'm gonna kinda of do a smirk up. Cap it off. Then I'm going to bring a U at an angle down. And so that's her cute little smile. And right here, draw a little light oval on both sides just to give her those cute kawaii cheeks. <laughs> and so we cut the girl sushi in. Now, Mr. Wasabi. <laughs> okay, so I got room for some wasabi right here. So I'm going to draw a curve. Down. So this is my top. I'm going to bring it around. So basically a dollop of whipped cream looks like it. Up. Or I guess it could be it could look like poop. <laughs> I hope you don't think it looks like poop. <laughs> and another curve. Once I color it green, I hope you don't think it's poop. It's wasabi. Okay, so I got my little dollop in there. And I'm going to give him these silly eyes. So wasabi always makes me cry. So I'm going to make him really stressed out and crying. So I'm going to draw two angle lines. A middle one that curves down. So the same thing, two angle lines. Middle one that curves down. And two angles at the top. And his mouth is down. Down. And I'm going to connect it with two curves. <laughs> so see, he's in distress. <laughs> and I'm just going to give um, T 
tears because he's crying and because he's Mr. Wasabi and his hands right here on his hips like that. <laughs> Silliness, right? <laughs> but I hope you think it's cute since you're coming here. And so finally, I'm going to draw my um, soy sauce because you can't have uh, sushi without soy sauce, right? So I'm going to come here. I'm going to draw a curve that comes down. So a curve. So there's the top of the soy sauce. And I'm going to bring it around. This is the top. And this is the lid part right here. I mean, not the lid, I'm sorry, the spout. So we angle it and bring it in. And then um, I'm going to continue my bottle. So this, that was the lid. I'm going to continue it down for the neck part of the bottle. So it's the same thing on the other side. And I'm going to curve it out for the bottle part, the body. And I'm going to end where my plate ends. There. And let's, uh, let's try the same thing, other side. Curve. And connect it. So you got a bottle in. And so right here towards the top, let's put in our cap. Nice red um, soy sauce cap. And right here we got to put some soy sauce in. So I'm going to come here and basically trying to draw an oval. Right there. And then come in here for some details. Draw some bubbles. Because soy sauce does bubble up. So maybe right here, no bubbles. To make it look like soy sauce. And let's bring uh, this soy sauce bottle to life. So once again, to draw so cute eyes. I think this is the most draw so cute eyes I've ever done in one drawing. And I'm just gonna go ahead and draw this really quickly. And cap it off with two little curves. And he is really happy. So curve up, cap it off, and bring it down with a big U. And the tongue right here in the center. And the little drop of soy sauce right here. And maybe just a little line right here to give him some, some um, dimensions. Fix my soy sauce. So there, my sushi set with my two little pieces of sushi, wasabi, and soy sauce. Hope you guys like how I drew them. Thanks so much for watching, and please subscribe so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.